No. No, it's not. <laughs> it's just a thing, basically. So, hello. Hi. Um, I'm Aaron, obviously, and I'm gonna show you my slideshow, and then I'm gonna do you a quick song for you guys. So this is slideshow is about how to become a Michael Jackson impersonator. First, you gotta start with your name. You gotta put your name. you gotta put Jackson somewhere in your name. Wherever you want it to be, you gotta put Jackson somewhere. So first, to be a Michael Jackson impersonator, you gotta pick which era you wanna go for. There's the thriller era, the bad era, the dangerous era, and the history era. So for this general idea, you gotta pick like for hair wise. I'm going for between these two because this guy is kind of short, and then you got crazy. And then you gotta pick the song you want it to. And we got a list of songs here, but you gotta pick between generally two popular albums, which is Thriller and Bad, because most people know those two and not really dangerous or history. And then you, step three is for research. For me, it took it didn't really take a while for me to do research because I've been doing research for like most of the year before the past chart that came up came up. But first you gotta pick a, after you pick your song, I'm doing beat it, so you gotta pick your song outfit, which you got the thriller jacket, the beaded jacket, the blue jean outfit, and you got the Earth Song jacket, so you look generally like how he would perform it. And then you gotta pick the audio for the performance, and I probably don't have enough time, but these are different versions of one song for you to pick from, depending on length and what type of time you have. And step three is the research your dance moves. So basically, what you gotta do is spend a lot of time where in a closed space watching videos upon videos upon videos. Basically going on YouTube and look at Michael Jackson Live and the song you want to do and different ways he did it, right? And then you have rehearsal and practice and practice. You gotta practice with the moves, like how you would glide across the stage. You gotta go like, practice like that and then you gotta practice the moonwalk if you got to and the dance sequence for the song, like the set of songs, the set, the set of moves you would do for the song. And then finally, you have your final performance, which I'm going to give you in this little space here, quickly. And I'm just going to do a quick audio check, and then you guys good for a quick performance? Yeah. I want to give the energy. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. I don't care if you do tape or Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, whatever put down there. Do you have, a, you have like a, a, thing, a hashtag? Push your hashtag. Hashtag. Push it. Hashtag MJ's Alive 2016. Oh, wow. So it's a conspiracy theory. Let me just do a quick sound check here. Sound check, sound check. Testing. Testing. One, two. Is that too loud? Yeah. Yeah. No. You're yeah. 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 Yeah.
passion project. <laughs> Thank you, Liam. <laughs> no questions at all? Let's do another song. <laughs> I think I gotta let other people go for I do another song. <laughs> yes, Max? Or you get the jacket. By Miss Landon's brother? Yes. <laughs> My brother in law has an Aaron Beadwork level of Michael Jackson obsession. Oh, wow. Uh, he has the Beadwork jacket, he has the Thriller jacket. He's been in a Michael Jackson music video. Can we show the video? No, it's fine. Okay. Um, <laughs> and he's like obsessed. Uh, he has some band moves of his own, so Christmas and Thanksgiving is always. <laughs>